Hi guys, hello and welcome to yet another episode of Project Perfumery India. It's my Diwali exclusive episode. First of all, I would like all of you, my viewers, my buyers, my non-buyers, my future buyers, a uh, very happy and prosperous Diwali. Uh, this year has been, you know, a more of a turmoil and Diwali actually signifies the uh, defeat of the dark or it is the festival of light. So it says it's... Uh, the defeat of the dark so the whole 2020 has been like that and with this diwali we are starting it all new with a bang and let's start it so what we have today first of all i have completed presentation of uh the fragrance which i've shown you last time that was alexa white so let me show you that then we have a word diwali surprise let me I, i'm like uh, i can't wait to show you this presentation this one of my ideas i got it like three four months back so i'll tell you how the whole thing came from uh, my in-law side have the whole business of this cracker so i have heard the story from my wife uh, they used to make these bombs and everything you know very uh, more like a garage actually at their house that's how the entrepreneur is and they used to make these bombs with wrapping around the jute uh, rope or the strings. So from there, it got me, it stuck me an idea. Why not? Let's do something like that. So here we go. This is called Sutli Bomb or Sutli Bomb by Perfume Logist. This is how the whole presentation looks like. If you guys do not know what it is, if you're not in India, I'll tell you it's more of a firecracker and this is one of the most powerful one. It's the beast mode one. So I'll show you the how the actual one looks like. Right, so this is the bomb that I have made. It's my 50 ml bottle and this is the color of the juice. It's, it's a really potent juice. That is why I've been named a Sutli bomb. I'll tell you the fragrance notes as well but after my next one. But this looks, this is a, one of the most unique presentations I have come up with. Perfumologist, Sutli Bomb, the notes, I'll tell you the notes, it's whatever is a dominant note, the green, and I'll come to that. Right now I've completed presentation of one of the last videos which I've covered. So it's Alexa White. So this is how it goes. It's a very elegant looking white box with golden print, Alexa White. This is how it looks, all white and made in India. We open it. Here's the bottle with similar looking label that is white and gold with black bottle. And this scent is one of the best, freshest scent ever, period. Amazingly good. I finished off like three bottles already. Fourth bottle is on the way. People are buying backups already because this was a limited launch. I... Uh, it's all green because we made the bombs today. So yeah, this one is uh, live on perfumery now with full presentation. A lot of people bought it when it was without a box or even without a label. So guys, don't miss out on this because it's a limited drawn and it's inspired from Office for Men by Jeremy Fragrance, Fragrance Dot One. That cost around two hundred dollar, two fifty or two hundred euros. This is like fifty dollars or even lesser in India. So if you are buying international, it would come to you fifty dollars shipped inclusive shipping in India it's even less than $50 so this is 50 ml extracted per far do not miss out on it and if you have already bought it from me tried it from me do post your feedback below and now second is the twisted version of the same there is same Alexa white but with the black label so I posted this on my Instagram uh, people thought it's the same scent but it's not I'll tell you what's the difference so how Alexa white is very fresh Juniper berries, grapefruit, a little bit of pineapple, a little bit of ambroxan, and it's very fresh and clean. So what I have done to it, it is such a nice and soothing DNA. That's always a hit. So and then I had my own DNA of Berong de Bali. So I've added a little bit of Berong de Bali in it, and it has given it a very solid bergamot and dose. I mean, slight dose of oud to it. So it's not a oud scent, but it it has got that. Uh, slight rosy wood vibe on top of the original office and i'm loving it so i would say it's like not too much of a difference i'm listing it as a separate uh, product though but yes it has got its own good things it's with added rose turkish rose in wood that's our belong de bali so i've added it in very small concentration to give it more depth that is for today coming to the notes of my Sutli bomb. So let me tell you what I've done. What's the whole inspiration behind it? 
So smoothly bomb it though it, it it makes like boom sound and you can hear that sound from it it seems like it's coming from two kilometer it's bouncing back to you that's because of the square box it has right and uh, most of the people in India what they do they put more boxes on top of it so that they get that echo so that's like the bounce back so bounce back is the whole idea behind it so whatever I've uh, chosen as the base scent the primary profile because of the whole green color and this is jute which is actually kind of a similar thing to vetiver roots so for that reason i have picked up vetiver to it now coming to the when when, when you know it, it it the actual bomb uh, the cracker contains a cardboard box with gunpowder powder in it so what i've tried to do is to create that gunpowder kind of vibe for that i've used frankincense number one for that i've used violet leaf number two that's my additions to it and uh, number three i've added uh, there is a uh, smoked loban so it's like a different uh, technique it's called choya loban as well that's a technique to extract uh, frankincense so i'm using two frankincense in it so these are the main things so it gives it a very nice vetivery smoky at the same time a frankincense sort of vibe there's a lot of frankincense to it and then and it, it's made on top of a very nice oud rose uh, and smoke based scent so it's a niche scent on top of it i've added my natural element so i've tweaked it like 35 percent i'm not telling you what the exact base is but this is a bomb the moment i spray it it gives me a very nice vetiver a long so it's like vetiver for first five minutes it's vetiver then it bounces back so then it's like you have just burnt it you have just lit it and you're getting nice vetiver and it bounces back with loads of frankincense rose slight mirror and it's natural indian perfumery that you can smell it for first two hours in, and i'm using 65 percent aroma chemical as well so for after two three hours it's the base scent which stays for good seven eight hours more so this gives you good 10 12 hours the main thing for first two three hours it's actually a whole selection bomb so that's Suitly bomb by Perfumologist, my Diwali exclusive. Check it out. I have made like limited 20 bottles. I'll show you the whole making, how we have made it after this. It's Mohit checking out. Happy Diwali once again. All right, guys. So we are back in studio. Let me show you. I uh, You have been watching me, guys, almost every week. And this time we did more of a clearance on all the So let me show you how our studio looks like now. We have got the whole... Uh, sample of boxes, bottles, every are our new boxes that we have made, Alex MI2. These are all artworks, so a lot of time has gone into it. In entire lockdown, we have designed them up. Ecstatic XXX, Ginger Vanilla, Peru, Controversial Range, Blood Rose, Golden Cobra, Italian Web, African Web. So these are all our artwork. And same is on the bottle. Shiva Sutra, our top seller. We have BTC, Candy Sinister. So these are all our box samples. So uh, these are for the record that these are all we have done now. Uh, this used to be full a few days back. These are all uh, full sealed products. We don't have much. Uh, last week it was all full. You have might have seen in my videos already. These are my leftover stocks. This is a limited edition Nocturnal Lude. I have covered in my last video. These are my upcoming. The boxes are in making. So we do it like batch wise. This is my Mysore 571444. It's a natural sandalwood scent, amazingly good. I'll be covering this in my next video. Uh, so I'll be waiting for the boxes. We have Jivara MI2, the made in India version of our uh, Sawash clone, going for 9.99. We have Sandans, Tuxes, Sugar, x Store, Antivenom, all, all of our top sellers here. Uh, Alexa White, we have these many bottles left. And Alexa, the black label one, we have just 12 as a limited edition. So coming back, this is the work we have done so far. I'll show you the first step what we have. So guys, what we have done, this is our bottle. We have got this jute rope from the market. We've got the green spray paint and we have just painted them whole green to give it that Suitly Bomb kind of vibe. What we are doing, we are wrapping them up. Let me show you the whole process. It's a like very tedious process but kind of fun because i try and do such things on every festival like on shivratri we did boom shankar and holy i was uh, planning to do holy fuck but then uh, 
uh, due to COVID thing, we didn't do it. And on Diwali, this was my idea from three months back. So I researched about the paint we use, the jute we use. I told you it, it used to be, it's still my in-laws uh, family business of making these crackers. So I got a fair idea about it. Now let's get the work going. Right guys, so it is too much of work. That is why this is a limited edition thing. So one thing we have to ensure, it's a whole string till there. And we have to keep it like really, really tight. So for now, we are doing just one side. So let's get this ready. Everyone makes perfumes, guys. Perfume is, of course, the main essence. But adding a little bit of personalization to it, the art factor is what makes perfumery. That's, that's how most of the big brands, you know. Uh, and I'll tell you, a lot of good houses have these RT bottles. Nasa Mato, for example, created those crazy caps that after that the whole cap culture started in perfumery. Then George Off came up with a uh, spiked cap, Rosa came with Swarovski cap. So these are like artworks. Uh, House of Wood bottles I love, the dragon neck shaped bottle. Uh, then another presentation, Ramon Malvisa, they use like 24 karat gold. Amazing bottles. They do such a nice work on flacons. Same way, another one of my favorite presentation is uh, the House of Siaj. They're, it's like women fragrances. Their bottles are, again, the cap work is amazing. So I really love those houses who put a lot of effort on presentation, the creativity, uh, as you know, that, that completes the whole package. For that reason, you know, I could, I did Alexa White as just hashtag office before, but then I thought, why not add the minimal presentation to it? And that too made in India. So for that reason, I didn't, uh, I, I did that. Now coming to the soupy bomb. So we have done with the wrapping. So yeah, let me show you guys what we have achieved so far. So we have a tightly wrapped bottle, which looks amazingly good. A lot of people would say this is a very simple thing to do, but main thing is to come up with the idea and execute it in record time and that too in scarcity of resources like we have here in India. Right guys, so that's my bottle ready. We would be putting the final touch that is the label to it and that's this one. So let's see what we have ready. So guys, one thing, these are all hand rolled by perfumologist. That's one thing. So whoever is buying these, I just, I don't have many, I just have 20, 25. So whoever is buying, get a personalized hand rolled bottle from me. And yeah, I'm putting the labels now. So that is the final step. Now this is, this is my bottle, which is wrapped up. This is the red thing. Because in, in India, if I, I, I don't, I'm not carrying the actual cracker thing. Otherwise this exactly comes pretty much like this. Right, and here comes my name. And right, let's put the labeling. Like how we have the brand names of those cracker companies mentioned here. I have put. Perfumologist, we're pretty much done. And that is my Sutli bomb ready. And and guys, I love this scent because it's it's come out like really good. The vetiver and frankincense combination, and ooze rose and dry down. It's a beast mood green scent. Yep, check it out. It's Mohit. Happy Diwali to all of you. I'm gonna see you soon. Bye.